So today I'm going to show you how to factory reset the operating system Android 9 and I will be formatting a smartphone Xiaomi Redmi Note 8. I'm going to show you every menu and option you need to press to accomplish this task and the time this process takes. But attention, because the factory reset will erase every personal file and application installed on the smartphone. So you should make a copy of everything you will need before formatting. But before we see the video, hit the like button so I know you like this type of videos. Subscribe to this channel not to miss the next videos I will be publishing on tech, smartphones and operating systems. And during this process, leave a comment. What do you think about this smartphone? The Xiaomi Redmi Note 8. Do you know any problems with this smartphone or any problems with the version 9 of Android? Because some problems were corrected in the newer version. So let's start the process and format this smartphone with Android 9. In the smartphone, we should click in settings. Then about cell phone and copy and restore. And the new icon on the bottom saying reset phone. We get a warning saying resetting the smartphone will erase every file on the phone and we'll have to wait 10 seconds so we can continue. After that time we can press next. We have another warning saying to be sure that you have a copy of all files because everything will be erased. We wait the 10 seconds and then we can press OK. The smartphone will be restarted and start the process of installation. This will take some time because every file, every data will be read for the memory to start the process of installation. While we wait, you can comment about this process and about this smartphone and don't forget to subscribe to this channel not to miss more videos like this. So, this will take some time. The process is being done. We can see on the bottom some dots flashing showing the process is being done. This can take up to a minute but I will not cut any of this video to guarantee the time that will take for the complete process. So, we'll wait. It should be almost done. Let's wait a little bit. Just a little bit. Come on, smartphone. Okay. It's almost done, it have restarted, we have another menu and we have an arrow. We can press that arrow to go further. Now we can choose the language. After we choose the language, we can press on the arrow to go further. Now we can choose your country and go next. Choose the wireless network you want to connect. I will skip this right now. Now the terms and conditions about the operating system. We make a check saying you read it and press next on the arrow. Now it's trying to detect the SIM card. I will skip this right now. And now the service of the Google. You can check or uncheck the service you want or don't want. And after you choose everything you want, you click accept. We wait uh, just a few seconds. It's making the configurations for the next step. This should be quick. Just one more moment. Now the password for the smartphone. I will skip this right now. Now some additional settings. 
you can uncheck what you don't want and then press next on the arrow and after you choose everything you want or don't want you should press the arrow to advance Now you can choose one of two themes for the operating system and press next. You can press the arrow again and it's almost done. And some applications start to load. This is almost done. The operating system is being configured. The application are being loaded. And when it's done, it will turn black and the operating system will be ready and the process is completely done from the beginning to the end the operating system is ready to being used and this is how you do a factory reset of android 9 and everything is done if you like this video press the like button so i know you like these types of videos and subscribe to this channel not to miss more videos on tech, smartphones and gadgets I will publish. But I want to know your opinion. What do you think about this smartphone, the Xiaomi Redmi Note 8? Do you know any problems about this smartphone? And about the operating system Android 9? Do you know any problems? Because in the newer version some problems were resolved. I will be reading your comments and... I will see you on the next video.